Hey guys, Ray Burke, Spray Wash Exterior Cleaning, coming to you from Tallahassee, Florida. Hope everybody's doing great today. Hey, I have a video here of Apple Wash. Wanted to give you a little bit of uh, history on this product. Uh, Apple Wash is a uh, cover scent, surfactant, and dye marker uh, that's used in the soft washing industry. Whenever you use it in conjunction uh, with bleach, uh, the bleach destroys the, uh, the dye marker on there. The dye marker is used to show like where we've sprayed already so you're not oversaturating an area. Uh, it sticks around for just a minute. It does take a bleach to, to destroy the dye. So you'd always use it in conjunction with bleach. There seems to be some uh, rumors or myths should I say in this industry that apple wash stains uh, and causes property damage but if you track these musings back uh, it typically comes from one person in the industry uh, who runs a forum and used to run a uh, national organization that has fallen on some hard times recently um, he likes to get in there and manipulate and spread rumors that Apple wash stains. This is actually a video that I made about two years ago uh, whenever the unnamed person was running his mouth about it then saying, oh, it stains, it causes property damage. So I put that on Facebook last time and it got about 5,000 views. I went ahead and made it today into a YouTube video so I think even more people can get to see it now and see the truth about this product. And stick around to the end of the video and I'll make some more comments about certain promotions you might see uh, from a certain person who tries to pick winners and losers in this industry and exactly why they might be advocating some products and not others. Now I did this product in full time. There's no time lapse on there. Um, you'll see that the movie itself is about three minutes long to watch the Apple Wash action take place on there. Y'all have fun. Enjoy. Hey, do you like fun? I like fun. So just for fun, let's do it full strength, non-diluted, and see how long it takes.
little dirt, little dirt I missed. Hold on. Make sure that's not a stain. Well, I think that should uh, answer any questions we got. Wash on. So keep in mind, somebody keeps fomenting the idea that Apple wash stains. Most of this comes from one particular Facebook forum. Now, the guy who manages that forum, he's really, really good at getting other people to do his dirty work. He's good at starting rumors and getting people to talk about stuff. What's not known popularly in this industry is that this guy extorts vendors to talk about their product. The vendor of Apple Wash refused to fall for an extortion. They refused to actually pay money for him to market their product. So he's made it his mission in life to try and destroy Apple Wash. I've been using Apple Wash for quite a while. I'm very, very happy with it. I know the inventor of it. Uh, thousands of other people use it and they're quite happy with it. Uh, something else that's not popular common knowledge in this industry is the person that we're speaking about actually charges a lot of vendors money to market their products. So if you see this person that I'm talking about raving about another product, most likely he's a paid spokesman, but he never honestly discloses any of that information. So he'll talk about how one rust remover is absolutely fantastic, but he'll never actually tell you that he's getting compensated for marketing that product. He acts like he's doing a big service to the industry when frankly, he's just on the take.